there are no incurable diseases, only incurable people. This is a quote by my friend, Dr. Robert Morris. Dr. Morris is one of my mentors and is a person that inspired me to become a naturopath. And he's actually taught me that healing is much simpler than we give it credit for. We are so used to going to a doctor who uses this very complicated jargon with us. And if you're not practice in medical jargon, everything will just seem so unrealistically big and complicated and outside the scope of your understanding. But healing is not about using big words. It's about going within and allowing the body to regenerate. That's the superpower we all have. Our bodies are amazing. Now, Dr. Morris doesn't say that to judge people, to make you feel bad. He says that to say, you have to shift your mindset in order to heal. If we are convinced that we cannot heal our bodies, that will be our truth, that will be our reality. And when that is the case, we rely on the medical system to fix us. What does that mean? Well, it means that we're going to get procedures that are sometimes irreversible, that will affect our body, that will affect our hormones, that will affect everything in our life. And we have to really adapt to that reality. Now, of course, sometimes those procedures, those surgeries are necessary for and they're life-saving and your body will adjust to that new reality and recalibrate if you give it a chance. But before you get to that choice, before you get to that moment, because the life-saving surgeries are not all that, the that's really a small percentage. A lot of surgeries are actually useless if you took advantage of your healing power and really gave your body what it needed to regenerate your body. What does that mean? Well, it means cleansing. It means changing your diet. It means changing your mindset. It means changing your belief system. It means changing your limiting beliefs. It means really making sure you become a priority of your life. I know that because I went through it. I know that because I'm challenged day in and day out still now to not believe in myself, to, to say that what I'm doing is crazy, to be made feel bad for putting myself first but i know deep down in my soul that the only reason i reversed type 2 diabetes the only reason i, I reversed adrenal exhaustion the only reason i took decisions to make myself a priority to make myself number one to heal is because i realized that i wasn't taking care of myself holistically as much as i thought i was there were little things that i really needed to change and the challenges will come, but what keeps me grounded and what can keep you grounded is the knowing that you are in control of your health, that you are in control of your life. Because when somebody makes you feel like you have no choice, that can feel really disheartening, that can feel really disempowering. And unfortunately, it's emotional blackmail. And the doctor can do that, our families can do that, our relationships can do that. But ultimately, we allow it or we don't allow it to happen, right? So I want you to feel empowered to make decisions that are good for you. Trust your body. Make the effort. Even if you think, oh my God, I can't do that. That's, that. That diet is so extreme. Being sick, going for a surgery that you can prevent, that is extreme. Not living life, that is extreme. Just because our lifespan has lengthened by surviving on medication, that doesn't mean we're living until the end of days. I hope and pray that by looking after myself as I am, and 90 years old, if I'm still here, I am living life. Meaning, I can walk, I can tie my shoelaces, I can cycle, I can be outside, I can walk and play with my dogs, I can do things, I can still work, because I love my job. I don't have a, a job, actually, I, I, I live my passion. I can still do the things I wanna do, and I really want that for you. Ladies, especially you, if you're working with these hormones that sometimes can go up and down, I hear you, I feel you, I wanna help you. So let's work together, let's talk, let's just make it happen. Trust your body, trust your intuition and trust yourself and trust me when I say, if you make a little effort now, it will pay off long-term. I love you, bye.